Today we're going to demonstrate uh, how to continue medications once they're already in the system. So starting with the summary screen, you see this patient has some ambulatory medications already entered. Uh, you'll note some of those medications are not on formulary. Meditech actually does a pretty good job of uh, helping you reconcile those meds. So this continue from ambulatory button that's in the order section is where you press. And here's all your medications. I'm going to pretty much continue everything except for the Lasix. And I'm also going to continue these other non-formulary medications. It'll take me to this interaction checking. It's saying amiodarone and digitalis don't play nicely together. That's okay. I'll say okay. And then unfortunately it'll say the same thing again for the digitalis, even though I already entered it once before. The system is just not that smart, but um, take it as it is. The next thing it's asking is, what do you want to do instead of diphenhydramine, since that's not on formulary? The truth is it actually is on formulary. This is the test system, and it just doesn't know. So I'm going to actually just do IV Benadryl, just as an example. I know it doesn't make a lot of sense, but uh, as an example, it works. So I'm picking IV uh, Benadryl. And then the same thing for the iodoform powder. Really, I don't know what you would replace that with, so I'm just going to pick anything here. So I'm going to pick uh, potassium iodide just for example's sake. All right, and click select. And again, I'm not sure what dose or whatever, so I'm just picking something as an example. And now I have replaced the iodoform order with that potassium iodide. And those are your orders, and I would now save and pin this. Thanks for watching this demo.